system that's visible to the naked eye. Scientists are now going to classify it as a major, major bummer. Why am I giving you all this bad news? Well, between the pandemic and the murder hornets and the fact that the Tiger King lady definitely killed her husband and the black hole, that shouldn't be between, it should be among, but among all those things, you're stuck at home for graduation and that's really not even a top 100 problem. But I get it. This isn't the way you wanted today to go down. And, you know, all joking aside, you are graduating in the midst of two crises. We've got a public health crisis, which is real, and many of us know people who've been suffering because of it for the health reasons. And we've got an economic crisis on our hands, and all of us are going to be navigating that. You're entering the world. You're moving from basically the end of childhood to the start of adulthood at a time when the economy has some pretty ugly uh, prognostication coming. It's hit our state hard. It's probably hit your family. It's hit our whole country. And nobody knows exactly how we're going to beat this thing. But you know what? We're Americans, we're Nebraskans, we've got grit, and we're gonna beat this thing. We will bring the economy back. We are gonna beat the virus. We've got five different American pharmaceutical companies doing amazing research to develop a vaccine. We're gonna have to have a serious reckoning with the thugs in China who let this mess spiral out of control by lying about it. Your generation is gonna have a big calling. You're gonna have to deal with the consequences of all this, and you're entering adulthood during an incredibly disruptive time. But you know what that means? It means the fact that you're going to need grit and determination and resilience isn't just euphemism. It isn't just rhetoric. It's reality. And here's the good news. You all have the potential to have grit and resilience and determination and to get through this. That's actually what your late 